Maybe he put lead tape on his glove. That's what I'm saying. And lead tape will solve all your problems, Linda. The Reds began the day tied with the Nationals for the worst record in baseball. There's Junior. I put it on my goalie stick, too. Strike. That would be bad, though, wouldn't it? No, it's not heavier. really. It keeps it on the ice. Exactly. It beat the five hole. Thank you. Edwin Encarnacion, two-run homer, just his sixth. Reds lead four to one. How about Eric Burns? Three-run Jackson off Todd Coffey. Burns' 14th homer of the year. Game tied at four. Bottom eight, Norris Hopper. Off the bench and up the middle. Brennan Phillips scores. Reds go up 5-4. The four hopper from Norris Hopper is going to be the difference. David Weathers has 17 saves this year. Reds win. In Oakland, A's pitcher Rich Harden making his first start since April 15th when Canadian. he felt a twinge in his shoulder. Oh, Canada, Harden's yeah. struggling. I mean, the guy's talented, but he's injury prone, okay? Yeah. He should have went into hockey. Gotta get this pitching stuff. Adrian Beltre, fresh off his 5-for-5 five five performance Friday. Ouch. Yeah, he belts it. Off of Harden. That's Beltre's sixth straight hit, 13th home run of the year. Harden lasted two and two-thirds, allowed five hits, four and runs, 66 pitches. Mariners up 3-0. It's 4-0 in the fifth. Bags full for Beltre. All right, so much for the seventh straight hit. Mariners will not score in that inning. Bottom seven, same score. Eric Chavez up. Felix Hernandez dealing. That's nasty. Hernandez, eight scoreless. He'll have two hits. Mariners win. A's suffer their seventh shutout loss of the season. You don't have to be beautiful. To turn. All right. All right, enough. Prince. Yeah, I got it. Home run. He'll be a participant in the 2007 State Farm Home Run Derby. He's my pick. Prince is my pick to win it Monday night. Okay. Two home runs I wrote that Saturday. Down. He is 29, tied for Alex Rodriguez for the major league lead. Austin Kearns. Nationals up 4-2 to two as two come in. Tony Graffinino. I mean, I, I swore this ball was going to drop. How does Ryan Lang? shouldn't swear. I don't. But I really thought that ball was going to drop, but Ryan Langerhans, the great catch. Nationals win 5-4 to four despite Prince's two home runs. He's no Edward Scissorhands. Phillies and Rockies, Rodrigo Lopez. I got Johnny Depp in the show having trouble. Oh, Ryan good. Howard, 1-0 Phillies, and then there was Thunder. Change-up, and it's in a long way to left field. Whoa. Yeah, the Thunder. Last year's home Boom run the champion. I'm telling you, Mother Nature strikes his 21st. Ooh. Yeah, Philly's up 3 nothing. Colorado gets some thunder. A lot of lightning. I know. Summer. It's a crazy place, but it's nice to live. It is. All right, game. Hey, that's Ryan Spielborgs. His fifth of the year at three RBI, three hits. Colorado ties this thing at three. Todd Helton. Yeah. No doubt. Jamie Carroll comes in. Rockies go on a win. Phillies, one loss away from 10,000 defeats. Not a happy day. Like 86 all over again against the Mets. There's Woody Williams. Top five Mets down three nothing. Williams against Carlos Delgado. Met fans love to see that guy heat up. His 14th of the year. That home run came at 7:07 on yeah 7:7:07. Good karma perhaps. Mets within one to the ninth. Tie game at three. Sean Green in the box facing Chad Qualls. He went on first and two outs. Green three for seven in this game. Paul Laduca, who was 0 for 8, tries for third. Hunter Pence. Pretty throw. That ends the inning. Let's walk it to the 12th. Julio Franco's in the game with one out and a runner on second. Franco making things happen. Chris Burke. Burke. Does he have a gun? Green holds up at third. Mets go ahead run at third. Okay, some drama. Two batters later, Ruben Gotai. So much for drama. Inning over. Bottom 12, Hunter Pence up, bags full, two out. Joe Smith gets the job done, gets out of the huge jam. We're going to the 14th. Bottom of that inning, Luke Scott up with runners on the corner. Scott, it's deep. Oh my gosh. Celebrate, celebrate. It's a celebration of love by Carlos Beltran, the former Astro. A ridiculous catch to Rob Scott. The game would have been over. You got it, Carlos. Sorry. Bottom 15. Morgan Ensberg up. Not having a great hitting year. Two on one out. On the ground. David Wright. Tags third. Smart play. Throws to first. Double play. Let's go to the 16th. Remember 86? 16 innings. We know it. NLCS. Classic. Hatcher. Exactly. Lenny Dykstra. 17th inning here. Bill Trud up. And not only does he make the great catch, he drives in the go-ahead run. Jose Reyes comes in, makes it 4-3 Mets. Bottom 17. Now 5-3. Mark Loretta. Billy Wagner. 
And Ricky Lede ends the game. Wagner with a 17th save. This went 17 innings. It took five hours and nine minutes. 16 pitchers used. 505 pitches thrown. Another long game. Red Sox best record in baseball in Detroit against the defending American League champions. David Ortiz in the house. David Ortiz out of the house. First home run since June 20th. That's a two-run Jackson. Bottom five now, second and third, two outs. Big two out hit over the head of Manny Ramirez. Craig Monroe with the double, Ordonez. D and coming to score, we're tied at two. This one, as we mentioned, extra baseball to the 10th. Looked like the Tigers were gonna win it in the 10th. Base is loaded, one out, Hideki Okajima in, and he induces the ground ball to Eric Kensky. They don't get the double play. Need one more out. And Okajima really showed a lot of calm and composure in this jam. He gets Omar Infante to fly out. Big Poppy says, thank you. Bottom 11. Bases loaded, two outs, and look at Jeff Bailey. After all those years in the minors, he has Jason Veritex back. Top of 12, pinch hitter Kevin Euclid pinching for J.D. Drew, who makes 14 million a year. Euclid, though, flies out. Bobby C. gets the job done. Tiger bullpen, very good. Bottom 13, Gary Sheffield hit by Jonathan Papelbon. Sheffield would steal second, and then, for a moment, it looked like Coco Crisp was gonna make this play. Almost appeared to slow down at the very last instant. Sheffield swipes home plate, and the Tigers win in 13, number seven. Seven. Helps get the win on 7707 for the Tigers. Angels and Yankees, old timers day at Yankee Stadium. Soon to be 45 year old Roger Clemens, older than five of the former players who played on old timers day. And look at that ball sink. It's Cabrera, gets Kochman. Clemens went eight, one earned, three Ks. Bottom eight, boy. Monkey Cabrera had better games. John Lackey, very good. 11 Ks over eight. Then Shields came in. Then K Rod came in to the 13th. Jose Molina to first. Miguel Cairo dives. Bobbles throws wide. Got two errors on that play. I don't know why. Really only should have got one play. If the throw was good, they would have gotten the out. However, there's the wide throw. That's the error. And Howie Kendrick scores. And then there's Melky Cabrera. Holy shnikes, he struck out five times in this game. Then Derek Jeter, first and third, and game over. Cabrera outraces his 04 Red Sox teammate Johnny Damon to the bag, and the Angels win in third. Don sitting on 751. The Giants back at Bush to face the Cardinals. Top four, tie game at two. Oh, Barry, he's such a clown. Traded Looper striking out Bonds inside Heat. Bonto for two, two walks, still at 751. Rough inning for Aaron Miles. Top seven, tie game, two on, one out. Mark Sweeney. Sweeney on the ground. Miles a little bit too high to Albert Pujols. And a run would score on that error on Miles. It's 4-3 San Francisco. Two batters later, Randy Wynn. Testing Miles again, this time under the glove. Two runs would score. Second error of the inning for Miles. Next batter, Ray Durham. Don't tell me. No. This time, it's in the dirt. Yeah. Third error of the inning. With more on Bonds chasing history, Bob Holtzman. <laughs> Casey Blake looking to do his thing. Cleveland up 2-0 in the second. Two out, two on. Blake does his thing. Three-run home run is 14th of the year. And Victor Martinez followed with a homer, too. And the Indians scored five in the second. They had four homers in this game. That would be enough for Fausto Carmona. Aaron Hill, no contest. Not at all. I mean, Carmona then strikes out Reed Johnson. Carmona improves to 7-0 and in day games this year. Alex Rios, he can't even hold up. Top four, one out. Grady Sizemore. Looking large for his 15th of the year. Carmona ends up with his 10th win, and the Indians end up with a 9-4 victory. Braves and Padres, a matchup for the young and old 44-year-old David Wells for the Padres against 22-year-old Joe J. Reyes, not to be confused with 16-year-old Jojo, who had that hit, Get Out. Get Out. Although Reyes didn't last long. Chipper Jones, did would this Get Out? Mike Cameron, Milton Bradley, are you kidding me? Did Bradley make that catch with his bare hand? The Flavor Flav glasses. He sure did, and he looked good doing it. Look at those things. That's crazy. It's a top play nominee. Top four, back to Wells. He got frustrated facing Andrew Jones. 2-2 two, two pitch, outside for ball three. Two pitches later, the 3-2 pitch, outside for ball four. Jones walks, Wells' frustration growing. Next batter, Jeff Francoeur. The 0-2 pitch, called outside. The at-bat continues. Francoeur takes 
Bucks advantage. Golfs it out for his 10th home run of the year. And just like that, the Braves are up 3-1 to one on the two-run homer by Frank Corey. Now, after the homer, Wells goes in to talk to home plate up Ed Hickox. Hickox starts to walk away from Wells. These two go at it. In the end, Hickox get angry, and Wells is thrown out of the game. You know, in the offseason, Hickox get out. works for the Daytona Beach Police Department. Does he? Yeah, and said, Wells, good thing I moved out of Florida to San Diego. These guys keep going on and on and on. Get out. I told you somehow 16-year-old JoJo would get involved in this, but JoJo Reyes, he's out. JoJo White. Exactly. All right, it happens. Let's move on. Two on Mike Cameron. His 11th of the year. Padres up now, 4-3. to three. And JoJo Reyes would be pulled one batter later. Just to prove I was right. And we were talking about names that sound like hockey players. Well, how about Kevin Kuzmanov? Yeah, he's in the Russian Red Army. What he with Larionov? I, I'm pretty sure it was him. Anyway, he had the base hit. In fact, he had three RBI, and the Padres won eight to five. Better off. You know, when Saturday began, no player yeah. in the majors had more extra base hits than Dan Uglis, 51. No kidding. I found that very interesting. Yeah. That's Derek Lowe. That's not Dan Uglis. You'll see Dan Uglis <laughs> in this highlight. Okay. Miguel Cabrera, he's going to be in that 2007 State Farm Home Run Derby on ESPN. You know who wrote the State Farm jingle, the famous State Farm jingle? Who? Barry Manilow. Oh, he's so talented. Josh Willingham, two-run shot off low. The sinker not sinking. 11th for Willingham, and the Marlins up 3-0. 2-7, Hanley Ramirez. Oh, Mandy. He rakes it to left, doubles off the wall, four for four. He's the guy the uh, Marlins got in the big Josh Beckett trade before last season. Seven for ten in the series thus far. There's Ugla, no extra base hits. That's a single. It will bring home Ramirez. Dodgers have lost eight of 11 at home. That's not how you win divisions. All right, Royals and Rangers. Eric Bedard entered the game against the Rangers with the most strikeouts in the majors. Honestly, did you know that going into this highlight? Now I know. Yeah. You saw Sosa striking out Bird, Diaz, Linda, your analysis. Sammy came back. It was going on here. I mean, I like I like the way he mixed up his pitches, Butchie. Sammy Sosa, second all time in strikeouts. It's Randy Jackson, by the way. Sammy strikes out a lot. There's Wilkerson, who's been red hot lately. And this is a guy, you know, in the last few years in the majors has not struck out more than innings pitched. All of a sudden, now at 28, he's doing that by a wide margin. How do we explain it? Uh, Leo Mazzoni, you know. Not enough uh, tape. Maturation. Not enough lead tape. 15 strikeouts. Red Sox and Tigers. Gary Sheffield. Alex Cora, great grab. I need another look. Red Sox, though, lost the game 3-2 to two because of plays that didn't help them. Number nine, we mentioned the old-timers day at Yankee Stadium. Great hand for Bobby Mercer. Seven months ago, surgery on a malignant brain tumor and play to a line out sharply. Great to see Bobby Mercer back at the stadium. No question. Number eight, this is Nonito Donaire against Victor Chinion. Yeah. Yeah, and you can Ouch. see yeah, oh. a few more looks of this. <laughs> uh, Donaire wins the IBF and IBO flyweight titles. Get up. Can't. Okay. Get out. Yeah. Get out, JoJo. All right. Uh, more wedding videos. Oh, this is two in one me. show. Tony Parker, Eva Longoria. Let me see the dress. What do you think? I'm not. With well, I Ash. Not yeah. It's okay. They're happy. Pop was there. Sure. There's Pop. Terrence Howard. Cheryl Crow. She's everywhere. Who is on her arm though? Innings. Duffy's Cliff. Venus Williams flowers before the match. Trophies after it. Her fourth Wimbledon title. Her fourth. I heard you. The men's final fetter and it all. Can't wait for that. Well done, Venus. Giant plate. Serve your cheese and crackers. Uh, bagels, please. Number four, China against the Grizzlies. This is from Friday, and that was sick. Rudy Gay with a sick two-handed jam on Yi. I like to call him just Yi. Grizzlies win 86-77. Number three, get out your lead tape, Linda. Okay. Just get a big old strip of lead tape, put it right in the bottom of your iron there. Makes it heavier, helps get the ball in the air. That's what Peter Hansen does. Who does it? Ace. Shoots a 66. <laughs> Three shots off. Canada. Indians, Blue Jays. Franklin Gutierrez. Here comes Franklin. But there's John McDonough. Look at that arm. Is that show still on the air? Oh, yeah. yeah okay, good. That's, watch, it's cool. He slides, pops up. Yeah. And that's, go to your local Little League field and try to throw a ball that far like that. All right. After the show.